Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Today we are going to be talking about some of the newest updates. But before we begin with today's video, I want you to hit that red subscribe button so you don't miss any of our upcoming videos. Also, make sure to like this video, but let's jump right into the video. Ninja Legends 2 is a sequel created by Script Bloxian Studios by Script Bloxian. This sequel is an improved and updated version of the original game. It has different game mechanics and new features. The game is different from the original Ninja Legends. You will train elements instead of ninjutsu. The higher your element is, the more powerful you are. The objective of the game is the same thing as the original game, training element and buying blades and evolve to become more powerful. Apparently there are some brand new updates coming in February. What will the new updates add to the game? Let's find out. Number 1. New Map The first thing on our list is the update that will introduce a brand new map to the game. But why? The current island looks cool and it is definitely a nice map for a lobby. Well, according to an anonymous Roblox user, the devs are bored with it as it just doesn't look that good compared to other locations in their game. But what would change? Well, there are many theories. Some people claim that the brand new update will simply change textures off the main island, which doesn't sound that stupid. After all, the map doesn't really have great textures, so it would be cool to see some new ones. There are other theories though, some people claim that the main island will be changed completely, literally. According to them, the map will be so much different that you won't be able to recognise it. Do you think it will actually happen? Make sure to let us know what you think in the comments down below. Number 2. New Swords If you ever played Ninja Legends 2, you probably noticed that there are many swords in the game. And I mean it, there are just so many swords. You're probably thinking, but why would they add even more swords? Well, we can't answer that, but we can tell you about the upcoming swords. According to some anonymous Twitter user, the new swords will be something brand new. We don't have much details about them, but what we know is that they will be very expensive. What's more, they will give you a lot of ninjutsu. A lot more than any sword in the game ever had. What's more, they might add some amazing promo codes that will allow you to get some of these cool looking new swords. After all, it would encourage players to play the game more. Number 3. New Training Areas As you know, there are currently 4 training areas in Ninja Legends 2. To access them, you need to have a specific number of experience. In order to get that level, you obviously have to play a lot. But it seems like 4 training areas are not enough for some players. Although it takes a lot of effort to unlock them all, they don't seem to be enough. That's why the devs might be adding some brand new training areas. It isn't clear what they will look like, but there are rumours that the new training areas are going to be a lot bigger and better. The bad thing about them is the fact that they will require a lot of experience in order to be unlocked. While to some people it might seem like something completely useless, there are many players who would love to see new training areas. Number 4. New Loot Chests There isn't much info about this one. But some people claim that the devs are planning to add a brand new loot box. But what would it be? Well, it would be a reward for logging in daily that would allow you to get some amazing prizes, such as new swords or experience level. It would be so cool to see them in game. In conclusion, these updates might be introduced to the game in February. Well, it still isn't known when exactly, some people think that the new starting island update might be added just before the Valentine's Day, on the 13th of February. Others claim that it will be added much later, on 25th of February. The other two updates might be introduced to the game around the end of February or in the first days of March. These updates are truly amazing and it would be so cool to see them in game. Just think about how fun it would be to explore the hub island once again or to explore the new training areas. What do you think of these updates? Do you think they're going to be added to the game in February? Why? Why not? Make sure to let us know exactly what you think in the comments down below. That is all we have for you guys today. Thank you guys for watching. If you guys enjoyed the video then be sure to drop a like, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already for more Roblox content like this and much more. We will see you guys next time, take care until then, goodbye everyone.